I'm going to show you how to go from this to this. Just keep watching. Welcome and welcome back to my channel guys. It's your girl Becca Wiss aka your beauty Wiss and you're back watching another video. If you're new here and you love all things beauty, fitness and lifestyle, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join my little family. In this video, I'm going to show you the most easy way to get flawless lock rope twists and I'm also going to show you a common mistake that most people make when they're making their rope twists. So this is how my client's hair is looking before I did the little razzle dazzle and I'm just going to hop right into this video. So as you can see I've already started her hair and I'm just going to walk you through how I get my perfect lock rope twist. So I first start off by applying leave-in conditioner to her scalp and roots and also I applied some oil. I comb her roots with a fine tooth comb and then I apply my lock product. I work it in there and then I begin to twist her roots over to the right. So as you can see the motion that I'm making is going toward the right and she is about two months into her lock journey and this would be her second retwist just so you guys can kind of see where her hair is at. So I did this on the other side too. I just went in with some leave-in conditioner and oil. I put it on her roots and then I made sure her parting was nice and clean. I comb her roots, applied the lock product and then I began to twist that lock also over to the right. And I won't speed this video up. I just want you guys to see exactly what I'm doing. That way you won't miss the most very important step that's coming right up. So I just take another lock and I also twist her roots into the direction that the other one is twisted which is also right. So you always want to twist the roots of your hair when retwisting in the same direction. Now I want you to watch very carefully because the most important part of making a lock rope twist or two strand twist as some people call it, um, the most perfect. So as you can see, I'm showing you that I twist both of her locks into the right direction. So we're going right with her twist, but here's the tricky part. When you're making your rope twist, you have to start to twist in the opposite direction that you twist her hair. So I know that's kind of confusing and I'm gonna show you this again, but this is the most important part to getting that perfect rope twist. So anytime you are ready to make your two strand twist, you have to go in the opposite direction of the way that you twisted her roots. And I'm gonna show you this again because I know that part is kind of tricky. But before I show you this again, I'm going to show you what happens when you twist your rope twist into the same direction that you retwisted your roots in. Meaning if you twisted your roots to the right and then started your two strand twist in the right, which is the most common mistake that most people make when they're doing their hair like this. And your hair just won't turn out right. So here I am. I'm going to show you what not to do and the common mistake that people make. So we're going to start like the other ones just twisting her roots over to the right. Both of them will go over to the right but here's what would happen if you also start the rope twist over to the right and you should not do this. So I'm going to twist her roots over to the right and twist her hair over to the right and the reason you should not do this is because it just unravels so quickly and you will see what happens it unravels from the root of the hair and your twist will just be non-existent at that point and the crazy part about this is i really tried my best to do it as neat as i can and look as you can see when you twist your hair in the same direction that you twisted your roots it unravels it i don't know why it just does that it doesn't stay but i'm gonna fix this and I'm going to show you again how to properly do it in the opposite direction. Just remember to always go opposite from the way that you twisted your root and then you'll have the most perfect lock rope twist. So 
So I'm going to show you this again. I won't speed it up um, just so you can see exactly how it's done. So we're going to twist both of her roots to the right but then start our row twist over to the left as you can see. So twist to the right at the root and then row twist over to the left. Always go opposite. And if you're liking this video so far, go ahead and give it a massive big fat thumbs up for me and hit the subscribe button to join my little family. And there we have it, perfection. As you can see, I don't even have rubber bands on the end yet, but look how good that twist look. It stayed, it's not unraveling. It doesn't even have a rubber band on the end to hold it, but that is how you get a proper lock rope twist. So I'm gonna show you this one more time for my people in the back. Um, so we're gonna twist the roots again. You apply your oil and your leave-in conditioner. Also apply your lock product, and then you twist your roots over to the right. And I do that with two locks. I twist them both. And then once I did that and I start to make her rope twist, I would then start the twist in the opposite direction of that I twisted her roots. So we twist to the right and then we rope twist over to the left. Bring it down and around. And then voila, perfect lock or rope twists. So I'm going to let you watch me finish up her hair and then I will also insert another before and after so you can see the transformation and then also for me watching hair tutorial videos sometimes is so therapeutic so here's your little dose of therapy too. Alright guys, so her hair is all done. Here is where we started at, you know, hair on eek, but then I got her hair on fleek. So this is the end result. My client really liked her hair. These rope twists were so cute on her short starter locks. So yeah guys, that is your easy lock rope twist tutorial. If you like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up and comment down below. Let me know what other videos you'd like to see. And whilst you're here, don't forget to subscribe.